Bristol Community College President Dr. Laura Douglas says the U.S. Supreme Court's decision two weeks ago to end affirmative action admission policies at colleges and universities will negatively impact advances in making higher education more diverse. It's disappointing. It's sad. It creates a feeling of, um, you know, why do we have to take a step back at a time when we're really trying to make gains with equity. So there's a real sadness that comes with that. And I know that in higher education, we can do a really good job in trying to solve a lot of different problems. Mm -hmm. But the reality is that in states where uh, these decisions were made earlier, uh, we have seen declines in, in um, students of diverse backgrounds, and we've not been able to catch up to where we were before with these types of, of, of abilities with affirmative action. Dr. Douglas says Bristol has an open enrollment process where policy is not a factor in admitting students. She adds that for some programs that are more selective during the admissions process, particularly those in the healthcare fields, the college is taking a broader approach to filling those seats. Even before the talk about perhaps changes to affirmative action and, and race-based admissions, I'm just really proud of the leadership that we've had at Bristol and looking at holistic admissions. Uh, we've been piloting this in our nursing area uh, as a way to just build better nurses. Grades are not necessarily uh, uh, a great indicator of someone's ability to be, let's say, a good nurse or a good um, uh, medical assistant or dental hygienist. Uh, so we're doing these types of changes for all the right, right reasons. Um, and now we're, we're looking at the other health sciences programs as well that are more selective to try to use that pilot in nursing, nursing to learn how we can uh, continue and do some of these other rollouts for our holistic admissions. We're not there yet. We're still in a pilot phase, but we are learning. Uh, and I do think that this will have a really good impact on our diversity uh, uh, of students coming into health science programs. Dr. Douglas says while all students will continue to feel welcomed at Bristol, the Supreme Court's decision may have an impact on other elements at the college. This will not have a, a real effect on most students at Bristol Community College. However, uh, the decision by the Supreme Court will have an impact, uh, especially on our staffing. Uh, whether it's our faculty or our um, employees, our staff, uh, we rely on these pipelines for diversity, especially in areas that are very underrepresented. STEM, uh, health sciences, our doctors, you know, we've been really working hard to ensure that uh, we have doctors and um, uh, uh, dentists and other practitioners, physical therapists that look like our population and these are the these are the areas that will we will see some decline and we will be taking a step uh, back. Massachusetts remains committed to ensuring all segments of the population can access high quality education from K through 12 schools right through higher education. With around half of the state's students identifying as people of color, under 10 percent of teachers identify as such. Dr. Douglas says data shows that students who learn under teachers that look like them are more likely to succeed in school and seek higher educational opportunities. There's a very interesting statistic that says that if a black child has had two teachers that look like themselves by the end of the third grade, they are 30% more likely to go to college. So it is extremely important that our students see people that look like them, not just in color, but maybe with different abilities or um, uh, at different ages, different ex life experiences. These are all very important to our students to feel these connections. It very much spurs students to think about not only doing well where they're in school, but going on to college and also thinking about having a professional career. Dr. Douglas says over the last five years, the college has been successful in implementing an affirmative action plan to recruit a more diverse workforce at Bristol.